Hi, welcome back. Um, today I am doing a, I did like a small, well it's not small, I did a big Bath and Body Works haul. Boom! Um, they're having their two for 20 candles and I did do this before for the fall candles, the two for 20. It's such a great deal and it ends up usually taking me like into the next year. Um, I burn candles every single day of every single year. Wait, I burn every, <laughs> I burn candles like every single day. So to me, they get used up. So it's worth the money. So when they go on sale for two for 20, it's really um, a good deal. And I always try and get in on it. Anyways, I took my husband with me. And of course he has lots of opinions on candles only when he's in the store picking them out. But prior we had, I had bought a bunch on my own for the fall. So I'm kind of going to show you some of the ones from the fall I bought. So... Well, actually, just a few. I think you can still get all the ones that I am going to show this you. This one is Apple Crumble. And, oh, so good. This is, like, one of my favorite candles. This is the second one. I have another one just like this that I just used up from last fall. This is Baked Granny Smith and Macintosh Apples topped with Vanilla Crumble, Cinnamon, and Nutmeg. This is, like, the best one. It smells like cooking. So, Apple Crumble... And then I got Frosted Cupcake. Oh, that one smells really good. It smells like buttercream frosting. Whoa, well, what does it say? Yeah, fresh vanilla bean sugar cake batter, rich buttercream frosting. Mix it up and create an irresistible scent. Yes, yes, they you were do. like two for five. So yesterday was Wednesday. These were two for five. Hot buttered rum. Ooh, that one smells really good. And it, this one has like the... These are the white barn labels with the gold tops. This one is um, buttered rum, smooth caramel, and just a hint of bourbon. So that one smells really good. This one is spice, and it is blend of red cinnamon, spiced orange peel, and sweet vanilla cream. Smells good. Wish y'all could smell them. This is another one that's um, that was a fall scent that I had gotten. Now this one is local apple... As a sweet, as sweet as the trip to the local apple orchard each year, a delicious fall blend of mold cider, warm caramel, and sweet cinnamon. You can seriously smell this, the caramel in this one. This one smells like pure caramel and apples to me. So, Cider Lane. This yeah. was my husband's purchase. It's Fireside. This one seriously smells like a fire. We have been, this is the most consistent candle that is burnt in our house because my husband is obsessed with it. And like I said, he doesn't really have opinions on candles because I burn them when he's not here. And then like if he comes home, he usually just doesn't say anything unless it's an overly sweet smell or a coffee smell. Then he's like, I don't like that. Can you not burn it when I'm home? I mean, and I kind of listen. But like he has an opinion. He loves this fireside one. So... Uh, they have a lot of the fiery ones, like Marshmallow Fireside, and then another, a couple of fire -y ones, like, win I think the winter one has, like, a fire smell in it. Anyways, this is a blend of cedarwood leather, re rich, deep amber, um, yeah, and it just smells really good. It smells like a man to me. No. Okay, then this one is Vanilla Snowflake. This one smells like coconut, uh, Wait, creamy vanilla, winter mint, and a touch of coconut evokes a dreamy, snow-filled day. I smell the coconut and the vanilla and, like, I guess a hint of mint. So, that's how they described it. This is a newer one of their um, uh, winter candles. So, this one is vanilla snowflake. And I, I do, I like this one. This one smells really good. I mean, obviously, I wouldn't get it if I didn't think it smelled good. So, I guess it's all on your own opinion of and the things. last one I got is one that I have in a small one that's this size. And we both, my husband and I both really liked it. It's the mahogany teakwood candle. And this one has, like, the gold top. This has... Smells like a man's cologne, okay? And everyone is saying that this smells like Abercrombie and Fitch, like an Abercrombie and Fitch store, and it seriously does. So it smells really good, and he liked it probably because it smells manly. So we got this one. I say we as if, like, 
we always go pick out candles together but no I forced his hand in it so and when you do that it's like taking a man to the grocery store I mean your cart's loaded with like Cheetos and really weird stuff <sighs> stuff that's like expensive that he just like a bunch of crappy snacks you know and then you're like what is this I needed it or I mean like $30 butt cream, I mean who knows. The last two things is I used a coupon and since I went two separate times, like I went actually yesterday to buy the fireside candle. When my husband was with me, he was like, I have to get this candle. So anyways, I went yesterday to buy that candle and it was $20 just for the one candle. And I'm like, honey, this was $20. Like wait till it's two for 20. And he's like, I'll front the money. Well then today I got the email that it was like two for 20. And I'm like, um, yes, I will be going back. And so I called Bath and Body Works and I asked them like, would they do an exchange or like, um, would they do like a price adjustment? And they said, yes. So um, that's why I went back and got the two for 20 and then another set of two for 20 for the winter candles. Anyways, so the short version of this, since I'm like super long winded in this video and I apologize, but I had the opportunity to do two transactions, which meant I could do two of this coupon. So I have that um, app on my phone. Let me check what it is because I guess I don't know offhand. The app on my phone is called Retail Me Not. It comes up with coupons for, you can choose if you want the online or in-store. Anyways, I had gotten this through an email, but I just thought, okay, well, I will pull it up on this site and see if there's any other coupons. But anyways, the coupon was, if you spend $10, you get to pick out um, something from their regular collection up to $14 or $12, $12, up to $12. And so I picked out... Each time I picked out one of the lotion, I got this Cashmere Glow. This one smells like peaches and vanilla, maybe. That's how everyone's describing it. I would say yes. This one smells sweet on Paris. This is like the from the Paris Amour collection, but I guess this is a sweeter version. Oh! <laughs> oh, crap. That, like, lit... <laughs> Oh gosh, that shot like all the way up my nose. Oh gosh. Well, I am going to be smelling that for the rest of the day. Okay, this is Sweet on Paris, and it just smells like, um, I don't know, sweet. I'm like really bad. It just That's why I like those candles, because if you read the back, it tells you what it smells like. So, I mean, the guessing's over. But like with the lotions, they need to, to do that on the lotions. But nope. Anyway, it smells sweet. Sweet on Paris, that's what it smells like. It's a very fruity scent. So anyways, I got both of these for free. Okay, so that's my haul. If you like candles and you burn them every day like me, then run to Bath & Body Works. And I think it's this weekend only is what the email said. So go and get the two for 20. It's a great deal for those three wick candles. They last a long time. Um, I guess if I burn one every single day, it lasts me about a month. No. I'm, don't let me lie to you. I guess I can't tell you how long it lasts me because I don't burn the same one every single day. Like I have like a three open that lasts me a couple of months like between the three of them. So I don't know. But anyways, it's a good deal. So go and get the candles if you like candles because it's a good deal. How many times am I going to say that? All right. Thank you for watching. And if you're watching, I filmed another video. I filmed my iHeart I heart fall tag before this and I was super long winded I don't know I'm really distracted today uh, my husband's grandpa died and so we were at the funeral this morning and so I'm thinking maybe like I'm just frazzled but we had some downtime so I wanted to try and film these videos so anyways I hope y'all are having a great day and I will talk to you and I will see you all in my next video Mwah.